I'm Best Cat 8. Welcome. We are headed to the festival in LA. We on you fucking dummies. Real hot girl shit. The deets for the ring bracelet will be in the description box. You guys, the drive was amazing, of course, and the weather is so beautiful. It's about 75 degrees out. It's a perfect day to go to a festival. So this is my first Smoking Grooves Festival, and so I was pretty excited to be here. I think we got here about 11 o'clock. It looked like everybody and their mama was here. I think people were excited to get out. And of course, Mr. Means is always impressing me. I can always expect him to put me in VIP. As if I didn't already have enough bracelets on, I had on so many, I started handing them out. We were moving through the line and I saw her shirt. I wanted to tell her, girl, it's a few things on here women do need to do. FYI, if any of you are interested in my thoughts, I do touch on these topics in my book. It is what you say it is. You determine your worth. You could head over to infinitelyclear.com or Amazon to order yours. After the video, of course. Back to the festival. This is the LA Historic Park and it's really big. And they had, um, they set up two stages at either end. A little side note, Smoking Grooves actually started back in 1996 and I believe they actually debuted right here in Southern Cal. So you guys, we're making our way through the crowd and I looked up and saw this sign and it struck me. Of course, you know I had to take a pic. Don't worry, the party is about to get started. We had to grab our drinks first. I ordered a Manifest the Moment and Mr. Means ordered a Spiced and Smoked. The flower child in me embraces the hippie era and how everyone came together for music. And because of the pandemic, it felt a little surreal being in a crowd this big and being surrounded by so many people. And to make sure that I did not get lost in the crowd, I wore a burnt orange cat suit and a fedora. We both wore a pair of chucks. And my husband got a lot of compliments on his button up mushroom shirt. We just came here for the music. Let me tell you what is fact and what is true. I get high like, ain't got much to do. Come on and get up, get out and do something. How will you make it if you never even try? Come on and get up, get, get out, out and do, do something. Can't speak your whole life trying to get high. Cause you and I got to do for you and I. I imagine this is what Woodstock felt like. So we made our way towards the stage until we found our perfect spot on the grass. And as we always do, no matter what the beverage, we make a toast and have a cheers. As you can see, they had a really great lineup. I think they had a good mixture of new and classic artists. What's good, y'all? What's up, y'all? <laughs> so I'm about to tell you something and I want you to lose your fucking mind when I say it. This is my first show in 855 days. Thank you. So we have a short time, which is about to just get into it. Y'all ready? Unconditionally, what? Because I am a queen. My mama said, "Hey, what she went through, what she knows." And then I got a 
had a cherry crew. Thirteen and I got a relaxer. I was the source of so much laughter. I was fifteen and I couldn't have asked for a better first show back. This is incredible. I did not know what to expect, but this is even better than I imagined. having such a great time and so far the festival was more than I expected. It was so fun you guys and I can appreciate being here and my husband he always makes sure that we have a great time whenever we go out. That's our time y'all. Let's just celebrate this 855 days. I'm trying to keep these cuts short so I can abide by the copyright laws. We're going to do this one for the ones that came in here with somebody. Check it out. me there was a person standing pretty close behind me but I held on to my drink and I stayed in my lane that's what I do you got to read my book to find out how I got here this was the Jupiter stage and I believe most of the new artists performed on this stage Selfish. You're my ladies and I can't Baby, I'm selfish Let you oh, so yeah. Yeah. No one yeah. but me yeah. Baby <laughs> DJ Wills Last song, let's go Hopping in, don't stop Rockin' to the very very Up jump the boogie to the rhythm of the boogie beat Yes, now what you hear is not a test it's not a test. It started to get chilly when the sun started to go down, so we had to do a wardrobe change. Well, we layered. <laughs>
So you guys, Erica's mic abruptly shut off and she was like, I'm not going to waste your time. And basically she was done. She turned and walked off the stage. The crowd was not happy and it happened so abruptly, no one expected it. But even with all that happening, it was still a really fun day and a great experience. And I think we ended up leaving a little after midnight. My feet were sore, my legs were sore, and I was losing my voice. So it was time to go home anyway. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like button. And don't forget to leave me a comment and subscribe. Until next time, peace.